Simon Cowell, of course. Yeah, it is a big, big production. I think the key words there were Simon Cowell. Yeah. And Terry's got Simon today. And AJ's with Paula in New York. Night one was wild. Paula, what can we expect tonight? Well, we're in Miami, baby. X marks the spot for Simon and Paula's hyped-up TV return. Of course, with them, it's complicated. <laughs> that is too high. For them, it's about a $5 million prize and one shot to sing for their life. You've said it's going to be bigger and better than Idol. Why is that? Well, you'll have to just wait and see. Big expectations, so we're counting on showstoppers. Nobody's counting on this. I'm coming on! He dropped his pants and sent Paula running straight for the bathroom. Did you throw up? Did you really get sick? Um, wouldn't you get sick? Bazaar's great, but they're looking for people who can sing. Simon, exclusive with Terry backstage at The Tonight Show, talking about a guy with a great voice. Let this music heal like an overture. And a better story. Chris Renee, a trash collector with addiction problems, now 70 days sober. He was screwing up his life. He's now a single dad, and then he does this unbelievable performance. And that's what I love about the show. But you're the key single mom Stacy Francis had all the judges on their feet. She'd had a real tough time, was told at the age of 30, she's now 42, that she's too old. That was one of the best auditions I have ever heard in my life. You cannot deny the talented Miss Rachel Crow, all of turning 13 and performing like that. But she proves that it's that it's about the talent, not the age. Simon celebrating the launch with a gift to himself. Is it true you spent twenty-five thousand pounds on a pizza oven? I don't know how much it costs. I have... How can you not know how much it costs? Well, I didn't look at the bill. And he can't leave without one final jab at Paula. She's got to admit it, that she is totally infatuated with me. Oh hell, we're two peas in a pod. A very strange pod. But we're two peas. Day two of these peas tonight on Fox. End of the day. The title of the upcoming memoir, Total Recall, My Unbelievably True Life Story. The one question extra friends want answered. How is he so good at keeping secrets? This is Beyonce, four months pregnant. Still Sasha Fierce? I don't want to get matronly. Believe it. In her first sit-down interview about her pregnancy, Beyonce saying she's not going to tone things down just because there's a baby on board. A woman's curves when she's pregnant is so beautiful. I still find things that are really sensual, feminine, and funky. Britney Spears is turning 30. Take that in for a second. Britney, 30. She's not a little girl anymore, so is she worried about it? Nah. I hear, you know, the older you get, the wiser you get, and the more you know what you want, so hopefully it'll be a good, good year. And for all you haters out there, Brit Brit's just fine if you keep it to yourself. I don't really have anything to prove at this point, so it's kind of like I just do it for fun and see what happens. Oprah's in there, too. Oprah Winfrey is ranked number 139 at an estimated $2.7 billion. And what about this guy? Did he make the list? Log on to ExtraTV.com to find out. Well, from Girl Next Door to Super Reality Star to author Kendra Wilkinson and her man Hank Basket. What's going on? What's up? How are you doing? So let's talk about the book for a second. Yeah. Like, one of the things you did talk about was your postpartum depression. When I'm having heat flashes and I'm feeling claustrophobic, that's not all in the mind. That's mm. that's a body thing. We have to become understanding of the different mood swings in this and that, or <laughs> else it's going to be very bad. She'd be like, look. I mean, one of those moves. So and he would just run. So how'd you get over? Like, how did? What was the treatment process? I mean, I still don't know. I'm. A, I, I don't know. We're looking for a therapist right now, actually, and we, oh. we're all for that. The future is a little uncertain, but I know things will work out. How did you get in such uh, good shape? Uh, Dancing with the stars. I mean, that got me back on my feet. Hey, babe. I forgot how hot that dress was. Well, be sure to check out Kendra and Hank Sunday nights on E! New time, 11 p.m. So, yeah, yeah, yeah.